Hello, hello. So it is a new month, therefore I've got some empties for you and I'm actually really proud of how full this box is. <laughs> I don't know if I just got lucky and like everything just kind of ended up being used at the same time or what, but this feels good to have a decent amount of product in here because as we all know, a lot of us that love Bath & Body Works, we tend to hoard it. I'll admit it. <laughs> So it just feels good to kind of get rid of some while also being able to enjoy it. So I really like using up my products and I want to get better at it. So I'm actively working at it. And that's why I like to do these videos too. So to start, we'll do the candles because I usually like to start there. So this one, Inhale, Exhale, is from 2017. And as you can see, this is Eucalyptus Rain. has notes of eucalyptus, spearmint, and melon. And this one is not fully used. You can see that here. Um, I could not handle this one anymore. This was my first time burning it a lot and trying to use it up. And I do have another one in my collection. Because I thought I really enjoyed this scent. But honestly, it kind of made me sick after a while. Like when I'd burn it, I just would feel nauseous. So I don't know what that is about. And then it was also getting really sooty, as you can see. So... I didn't really want to give this to anyone because there's only a few burns left out of it. And yeah, unfortunately, I don't even want to open it to smell it <laughs> as like a last hurrah because I just can't. So I need to take a break from that. I don't know if the eucalyptus was just too much or what was going on, but I tried my best with that one. Now for this one, I enjoyed every second of it. <laughs> as you can see, it burned beautifully. Um, this was Peach Bellini. This was from the year 2018. The notes are succulent white peach, sparkling prosecco, and sweet orange. I'll forever love this one. It's one of my all-time favorite scents. I have plenty of backups of it, and yeah, there's a reason they keep releasing this one. It's because it's phenomenal. I really am sad to say goodbye to this really cute jar, <laughs> um, but yeah, it was just, it was time to burn one. I have plenty in my collection, so. And then I have a single wick in Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. The notes are not on the bottom of here, and I will continue to complain about it. But it's a really nice, fresh, fruity scent. And yeah, it burned pretty darn well, and it was perfect in the bathroom. And I was actually surprised with how well it threw. So I would definitely repurchase that one. And then I actually have some stuff that's not Bath & Body Works in here, and I just thought I'd show this. Um, I was gifted this item, and it has now expired, so I honestly can't even remember if I liked this or not, because um, it's been a while since I used it, so we just need to get rid of it, because it's bad, and unfortunately it's wasteful. I know that, um, and that's why I'm trying to start to use up like my older products. And then the other item that is not um, Bath & Body Works is this hair repair mask. And this is a brand based in Wisconsin, Woo. Um, which is where I'm from. And I still get this hair mask. I really like it. It makes my hair super soft. Um, but I used this guy up. And then I also used this pillow mist in the black chamomile. And I am obsessed with this fragrance. And the packaging looks different now. But I kind of wish it still looked like this. I love the aesthetic of this. It's so cute, but this is my all-time favorite aromatherapy scent. It always will be, and I will continue to use this until the end of time. And then I got through this moisturizing body wash, the Sunshine Mimosa, and I love this. <laughs> um, I got this when Bath & Body Works sent me PR when this scent first launched, and I was like, it smells really good, but... Will I want to smell like that? Yes, 1000%. I love it. I will definitely get this again. I'm currently using the shower gel, which smells different than this for some reason, and I much prefer how the moisturizing body wash smells. So yeah, I would definitely get that again, and I highly recommend it. And then my fiance got through fresh water. It was nice. I usually don't have much to say about the men's scents because I think they all smell pretty good. Um, but something about this one, I don't know... If it's like the moss, yeah, that oak moss note sometimes smelled kind of musty to me, <laughs> which sounds horrible. Um, 
So I probably won't get this one for him again, and I know it's going away. But it wasn't awful, it wasn't my most favorite one that he's tried. And then I have another product from Lebrai here. It's the Cucumber Body Wash. I used that up as well. Not much to say there. It's just a gentle, natural body wash. And then I have a car scent, which... Let me get the lid. So this was Island Margarita. It smells so good. <laughs> ah, I love that one. If you like fruity smells for your car, you definitely need that. Sorry, I can't see in here. Let me grab these wallflowers out. So I have three wallflowers. I got through this one, the Fiji White Sands. Love this scent. We'll get it in the wallflower again. Um, the notes in this one are fresh cut sugarcane, white nectarine, and sandalwood. And then I have two mineral springs, which they turn this really gross color. And I didn't smell them anymore, but these are ancient. And the notes in this one are soothing mineral water, night blooming water lily, and a dash of lime. And I really like this scent. It's like a really clean, I don't know, I don't want to say manly, but kind of, kind of manly smelling. And the last item is this Rose Quartz hand cream, which, oh my gosh, I loved this so much. And I love the packaging of this too, so I'm like sad to say goodbye to it. But I want this scent back. I feel like I need to do a video where I go through my collection and pick scents that they need to bring back. Um, let me know if that's a video you'd be interested in. But yeah, I was obsessed with this and I still have the fragrance mist of Rose Quartz. But we need it again. I really enjoyed it. So yeah, it looks like an empty box. So that's it for this month and I'll see you next time for those empties.